<laughs> that is about a half of your height, Claire. Yeah. yeah. I, um, I have to wear my slippers into the studio. Here's my slippers. <laughs> and then I, I put these on and then I take them off. When Get a stepladder, you know, climb into take... them, yes, all of I that. Do. No, I can't walk very well in them, but do you know what? It's a good effect, isn't it? It's lovely, yeah. Babe. Yeah, well, then I should, actually. Thanks lovely. very much. You're welcome. Um, hello, good morning. Good news, actually. Uh, sunshine for most of us through the weekend. If you don't see any on Saturday, you'll see some on Sunday and vice versa. And some of you might see sunshine from today right the way through until the end of the weekend. It is turning a little more unsettled next week, so make the most of the weekend because, as I said, it's mostly dry. You can see why clear skies overnight, hence the reason why we're seeing mist and fog. But then over the next few hours, an area of clouds will move in, moving in across the far north and the west of Scotland, clipping northern Ireland, but the rain really won't get going until probably the early hours of the morning. This area of clouds and rain will sink its way southwards as we head through Saturday into Sunday, but the, by the time it's reached probably Wales and the Midlands on Sunday, it will just be a band of cloud. This morning, watch out for fog. There's some mist and fog more or less anywhere across England and Wales. Favoured spots will be probably the, uh, the Vale of York as well as the Midlands. Central southern England seeing some sunshine this morning, but wherever you're waking up, it's going to be a bit of a chilly start. Certainly, autumn is uh, on its Way. It does feel quite cold out there. For Scotland and Northern Ireland, it's a bright start. The sunshine turning a bit more hazy through the afternoon for, I'd say, Northern Ireland. In the far north of Scotland, you're probably going to see a bit more in the way of cloud. There's a small chance you could see the odd spot or two of rain, but generally speaking, it is a, a bright start to the day. Through the afternoon, that cloud slowly moves in across the far north and west of Scotland, and again, there's a chance of some light rain. And for Northern Ireland,